What's up everyone? This week's gonna be another short episode. I got some big announcements to make. I got some issues to work through and I want to bring you on the journey. That's so beautiful. All right, so earlier this week, I got an email from Vimeo. That's the service I use to put these videos on my website. And it said that they were going to have to update their storage plan to where I'd have to pay um, to get more storage for my account. Meaning, I can't really put these videos on the website using that service anymore. So I'm gonna have to figure out a different service. Now, of course, I could use YouTube and stuff, and I've done that. But the thing is that if I continue to use YouTube, if you're ever watching this at a school or if you're a teacher and you're wanting to watch this video, you couldn't do that because most schools block sites like YouTube and things of that nature. So with that said, I might take a week or two off. I'm not really sure. I got to kind of revisit the plan and really see how I'm going to do all this stuff. With that said, I am now on iTunes podcast. If you go and you search the bold millennial, the bold millennial in that podcast, I give you business strategies. I give you motivational things. I give you successes that I make. I give you failures that I have. I give you a 360 degree look into my life so that you can learn from my actions so that you can learn from the things that move me and, and really work in my life. So hopefully they can turn around and move and work in yours as well. If you could, that would be so amazing. If you subscribed to that podcast, as I kind of revisit this whole Fred Talks thing, I will keep you updated on that podcast so you know exactly where it's at. So I feel like I'm using my hands. Like Trump, I don't know. Anyways, the moral of the story here is this. You are going to face problems in your life. You're going to face challenges. You're going to face obstacles, if you will. But what happens when they come to your life? Do you just quit and stop? Or do you take a step back, analyze the situation, and find ways around? How badly do you want to achieve that goal? Do you want it bad enough to where when an obstacle shows itself, which it will, that you're able to find a way around it to get to that ultimate thing? No, I'm not the one that can answer that. You're the one that can answer that. Email me at fred at friendmotivates.com if you have any ideas or ways that I can get around this challenge. And until next time, much love. That's so beautiful.